far. Yeah, I might go down to, is it seven, seven games, right? Seven games, okay. yeah, yeah, best four out of seven. Mm -hmm. Where those cities are going to have to chub me up some hot dogs. One of them those is. Stands. Yeah, they yeah. have that big yeah, bet. Yeah, the big hot dog <laughs> yes. bet. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I wonder if they're watching. Yeah. Uh, yeah. We'll see. Oh, wow. I haven't seen any of those games, but uh, it's been really nice outside to do other things. If you haven't been kind of sitting inside watching the baseball games, it's been very comfortable. Uh, this afternoon, we're going to have some great weather, too, if you want to be out and about. We had a little bit of rain overnight. This is actually a time lapse. Look how foggy it kind of is outside the steel bridge. See the rain, very brief, dries up, and that's all we're going to see as we go through the remainder of this week. I'll take you through that temperature tour this morning. Temperatures in the lower 50s to the upper 40s along the coast. Astoria at 48. Cannon Beach in the mid 40s. Good morning to you in Sherwood as well as Lake Oswego for this early morning. A little after 445. We have temperatures in the lower 50s. The clouds above are keeping the temperatures a little bit warmer this morning. It's storing some of the heat. It's not a lot, but storing enough. So temperatures are in the lower 50s right now. Battleground at 49. Uh, through the gorge, temperatures in the lower 50s. So just about everyone right around that mark this morning. And if you're heading off to the east, we have temperatures in the upper 40s to the lower 50s. Uh, yesterday morning, Baker City was at 20 uh, so a lot warmer there, about 24 degrees warmer for you folks. High pressure off to the west. It's going to be moving on in. We have that exiting low pressure. We get them battling each other, and that wind's going to increase as we go through the afternoon, uh, especially through parts of the gorge. I think we're going to see gusts up to about 45 miles per hour. So this afternoon, the day planner for the coast. Temperatures in the mid-40s, about 47 degrees by 5 o'clock, mid-60s. The valley at 60 this afternoon, 66 uh, for the afternoon hours. If you're going to be outside, going for a run or something 57 for the gorge 67 by five o'clock and just a few clouds passing through the central section of the state. So here's the wind forecast at least for uh, today. We start off our day uh, and then by the evening hours we're going to see that east breeze coming through the metro area about 10 to 20 miles per hour gusting to about 30 uh, through the gorge again about 45 miles per hour so breezy there. Uh, this evening we're going to see those gusts about the same maybe even a little bit stronger. So all of you uh, that like to do that wind surfing through the Columbia uh, in the gorge. It might be a good day for that. Uh, Friday, we're going to see the wind too, uh, gusting up to about 40 miles per hour. So it's definitely going to be breezy over the next couple of days. So with the sunlight out there and some clear conditions, just be ready for a little wind if you're doing anything outside. 65 by 5 o'clock, we have 40s over at Government Camp. We get through the overnight. Temperatures back down to the lower 50s to the upper 40s for your Friday morning. We get into Friday afternoon. Look at no rains passed on through. It's going to remain dry and those temperatures are going to be kind of hanging out in the 60s. Seven day forecast 68 on Friday, 69 on Saturday, a little bit cooler on Sunday, maybe a quick sprinkle. I, I think we'll probably stay dry though. 65 on Monday and Jenny, it's going to be nice where you don't have to go outside with an umbrella or some sort of water poncho or whatever. Water poncho, is that what Halloween I... On Halloween this uh, year. Oh, on Halloween, yeah, yes. Because yes, that will be it's nice. been so wet the last couple of years. Mm -hmm. Yeah, my uh, daughter, one of my daughters tried on her sumo wrestler outfit. Mm -hmm. It is ridiculous. There's like a fan in it that makes it, you're like a Stay puff marshmallow. <laughs> I, those <laughs> things look like they're so much fun. When yeah, you well, I just, on. I don't know how walking around is going to be. Lots of hills. So. She's gonna probably, hide. She could probably roll around in it. <laughs> She's gonna, gonna, gonna roll, roll her down the hill. Like, yeah. yeah. She's just gonna hide all her candy inside of her. Outfit. Maybe, maybe so. Yeah. Okay. All right. But good, good on the forecast. Yeah. Good news. Yeah. All right. The water poncho. Yeah. You don't need it. <laughs> Thanks, Joseph. Here's a question. Would you